Okay, let's try this again. Let us try... Let, we're just going to keep rolling the Watcher, at least for today. Is it a random relic? Or a boss relic? Boss relic! Ugh. Oh, I don't know if that's a good idea. I mean, if I can get do voodoo real fast we might be okay if i can't oh boy this is going to be a weird bad run we do get more energy though which is nice i need more draw that is that is a hundred percent uh a necessary thing okay so if i did this that would get him down to 30. you do 12 to me I could, I could erupt. Wouldn't really help me though. We'll wait on that one. If you could retain eruption or something, it'd be kind of cool. But you can't. Can't do Vigilance, and it's fine. Might have been better off killing him the other way. Uh, let's see, Sanctity, Bowling Bash, Protect. I really like Protect. Like, the Retain build was a good idea. Uh, let's lose a Defend? No, let's lose a Strike. Okay, that kind of works. Really wish uh, upgrading Eruption reduced its cost. I'd be more likely to use them. Uh, let's see, Windmill Strike? Yeah. Just going to old favorites. Do we get Regret? Probably a really bad idea. Let's go for the max health. Okay, what can we get here? No Duvu Doll. That's pretty much what I want to save up for. Alts. Fasting, fear no evil. Halt might be fun. We'll grab Halt. Do I go, grab anything else while I'm here? Consecrate's kind of okay. Got a boss coming in. Maybe applying vulnerability might not be a insane idea. I hate buying potions because it seems expensive. There's Windmill Strike and Protect. Unfortunately, we need to upgrade that to really make it work. But that's fine. We're going to do Windmill Strike in the next round, probably. Shit! Let's see, what do we got? We got another eruption. Strike and then strike. Okay. Not the worst Lagavulin fight. Let's see, Calm apply weak, Wrath apply vulnerable. Two block for each card in your hand. Tain, enter Wrath, exhaust. Crescendo sounds fun. Okay, we can toke away a card, but no, I think we wanna we wanna start by upgrading um windmill strike. Too good. So, Curse Regret sucks, but pays for itself if we can get another shop before we're done. Or remove it. Going for it. I'm a cursed man anyway. What's the worst that can happen, right? Lots. Uh, it's actually, let's let's take away Regrets. That's like the one that I, I don't want to hold on to. Okay, strike and 
Windmill, perfect. So adaptation, whenever you switch, maybe. Gain two mantra, gain vulnerable, add an insight to your pile. Grab prostrate. That sounds interesting. Uh, and you know what? Considering how freaking screwed we are on this run, I'm just going to go bananas here. We could do a vigilance. We could go... Okay, that's enough to avoid. Vigilance and a strike. We gotta kill that guy. Okay, we have protect, we have halse. We have doubt and we have windmill strike. I'm just gonna kind of play tanky for a bit. Okay, so I... This is not a bad time. I have Crescendo. That's okay. Oh, uh, it's just Pop Protect. I'm gonna keep striking that guy. I guess I'll defend again. So these dazes are gonna suck. But remember, right, these guys used to give you wounds, and that was hell. How much damage is that going to do? 18. Crescendo. Windmill strike, regular strike. Vigilance. We'll take a little bit of damage, but that's okay. Might have been a good time for the flex potion, maybe. Eruption, Alt, and Defend. I'll take one. Really hoping we get some not garbage here. That's kind of not garbage. We lose some dazes. Alt, Defend, Defend. Well, it's not really what I'm going for. But I'm not doomed yet. Oh, there's the strike. Mainly I'm just trying to get rid of things. We kill this guy with eruption. That doesn't happen often. Ink bottle, whenever you play ten cards, draw a card. Grab collect. Collect is good. So anger the mushrooms, get a parasite. Get the parasite! the start of your turn, upgrade a random card in your hand for the rest of combat. It does give me pain. Otherwise, I can upgrade a card in my... You know what? Curses. I don't have the card to justify this yet. But, like, boy howdy, I'm gonna try and make it work. Three mantra. Alt protect eruption. It eruption might not be a bad idea. Let's grab collect plus, though. Okay. Uh, let's see. So what do we got? Honestly, best option? We already have Crescendo, so we can just hold on to it. Let's just hit Collect. We also do have another uh, Essence of Steel. So he is going to slam a jam me on the next round. I've got Protect. I think I'm just going to... Take it here. We've got protect, we've got defend, we've got two strikes. And the next round we're gonna crescendo and just start hitting him. Not enough yet, I'll be okay. Maybe be okay. Probably should have pop popped the flex potion there. But that's fine. This is an okay round for it. 
keep popping those. Luckily, we've got loads of energy. I think it's gone now. We had loads of energy, but this is fine. I'm just going to kill this sucker with eruption. Just because I can. Uh, let's see. Do we do... Strike. Strike's going to do nine to him. We're hella weakened. I could just do Vigilance and then Protect. Let's let's do that. Okay, what do we got? We got a Prostrate. <coughs> this is going to hurt me that much. I... If you take the extra damage, we'll take the extra damage. And if you're wondering why, it's because I'm silly. Okay. We got a lot of curses in my deck. As long as it's not decay, we're okay. Doubt's kind of annoying, though. What's insight? It's not really what I'm looking for here. I could do eruption, but that would kill me. I don't really, I don't really want to get wrecked here. Alternatively, eruption, and then vigilance. We have pain. Oh, that's annoying. Oh. Well, that's a little bit... This was silly. At least I can kill that guy. I am I am doing silly things. Because I can. Prostrate some more. And then keep blocking. I kind of squandered Divinity there, but I guess it's okay. We should probably get rid of that Pain card, maybe. Reach Heaven, Thorough Violence, Signature Move for Omniscience. I like Reach Heaven. That sounds fun. So we could do Black Star, or we could just do Sozu. So, no more potions, but energy for days. We're, go we're doing Sozu. Blackstar was fun, but I want to ride the Mystery Machine. Probably. I really want to find Duvu Doll if I can. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Do we have any high shops? We do have a high shop. Yeah, we could actually, we could do this. Couple of bonfires, mid bosses, and a shop up high. Ideally, we get multiple. We'll see. Uh, let's see. Collect. Heck yeah. Okay, so we do have pain. Pain sucks. I guess I'm just gonna protect for the time being. We'll wait for. We'll wait for pain to go away. Yeah, the main problem is we need heavy draw to justify these. Heavy draw or really expensive cards to justify all of this. Because otherwise I'm just going to be taking a whole bunch of extra damage. Uh, and I'm going to have a silly amount of energy and nothing to use it on. Okay. Well, eruption. Strike. Strike. Could you reach heaven? Hit him for 16.
Oh. Well, that was foolish of me. I... My math was bad. Oh well, I guess he dies. See, do we want to do swivel? Clear the mind. Grab sands of time. Let's see. Strike, strike. Probably could have just done sands of time instead. Yeah, I think this run is is Dunsky, but I kind of did this to myself. Vigilance. We could do a crescendo, but I'm just gonna. Well, I guess we could just save crescendo. There's windmill strike. Uh, strike. Sands of time. I'll just hit him with windmill strike. Yeah. I think this this run was kind of D DOA just because I didn't really understand I should even build this. But then again, I was just mostly hoping we could get Duvudal at some point. <laughs> I'm also very rusty at this game. It has been a while. Uh, let's see. No. I can't kill him. But he can kill me. Well, I think... I don't know. I don't know. I think I might just chuck that in the... Eh. I'll put it up. I have no idea how this series is going to get edited together. It's going to be a litany of failures as we go along. But that's kind of normal. Let's see. I'm going to keep losing my starting relic for Snacko. Okay, Sneko might be interesting. We've got some seriously expensive cards. I also see three mid-bosses and one hell of a mystery machine. Uh, and a lot of exit points. All right! I don't know where this is taking me. Fun places. So, Eruption is damn expensive. Otherwise, we could do... Let's do Vigilance now. Damn it, I was really hoping for a free strike. It's nothing but free defense and expensive strikes. Well. I went in doubt. Just ride the bus. Eh, that worked out. Okay, Deceive Reality. I want more expensive things. Cut Through Fate might not be a bad idea, though. Anything with draw. Swivel is damn good. Can I get both? Yes. Devotion and Swivel. Because we want anything that costs more than two... Or has a cool power effect. So we're going to grab Devotion. We're going to Swivel. Or Free Strike, and then another Strike. Close enough. Free Eruption. Strike. And Cut Through Fate. Okay, Protect, Foreign Influence, Crush Joints. Protects, obviously. Anything that's expensive is worth it. Ooh, courier. Smiling mask. This looks like a shopping run if I, I ever did see one. Okay, let's just pop devotion and just wait. Could I do? I could do a swivel and a couple of strikes here. It's not a bad idea. Swivel. Eruption. Strike. 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 And we've got Protect on the next round. We could also just roll Vigilance.
Take the damage down. And one way, one way or another, free defend. Do vigilance. Another free defend. Free protect. I don't take damage. Probably best. We got three mid bosses here, and that's that's a spook. Uh, I don't really like this. Well, I'm gonna doubt swivel, I guess. Uh, let's see, and block potion. Okay, do we do? Let's do eruption. Defend, defend, cut through fate. Get rid of the defend. You can see the prices. No, you can't. The prices are a lie. Strike and strike. There we go. Pocket watch. Whenever you play three or less cards during your turn, draw three additional cards in your next turn. I don't really like any of these. And I'm too poor for too, for most of these. So we're just we're just gonna make progress. Hit him with explosive potion. Okay, so I could do an eruption. But let's do a devotion, defend, strike, and defend. We'll hold on to protect for the next round. I wonder if Protect's cost gets randomized every round, or if it's on draw. It's every round. That's awesome. So, Cheap Vigilance, obviously. Defend. Strike. Let's see. So, they're going to hit me for a decent amount. So, we're, we're just going to keep striking this guy. can't kill him yet. But I'm going to do that. See if I get anything cheap. The answer is no. That's fine. Yeah, pocket watch is kind of a neat combo here. Because now I just have options. Okay, swivel. I don't was not paying attention to which one of these was expensive. I think this one was pricey. No, I was wrong. And we've got Divinity coming up in one more turn. So hold out until then. See, if I just defend again, I'll just wait. Okay, so my hand is super freaking full. I can erupt, kill that guy. Does that mean I do silly amounts of damage? No, because I ended the I ended the divinity stance. So the two of them do not sync together. Good to know. Makes sense. Whenever you climb a floor, gain gold. No longer works. When you spend gold at a shop. I mean, I'll grab it. And we obviously want Nirvana, because Nirvana is awesome. Gremlin Horn. It's kind of nice. Uh, let's see. Do we keep mid-boss hunting? I didn't even take that much damage. What's this do? So, innate. That makes it really damn good. Devotion would be nice. Getting multiple devotions... Would be insane. Let's start with Nirvana. Kill 12 or get Cursed Regret. I'm going to go for the max HP. We go for the mid-boss, do we go for an upgrade? Mid-boss could hurt. Could give me something nice, though. Problem is, if it's anything like Gremlin Knob, this gets dicey.
I'm gonna play it kind of safe. We're just gonna smith. Let's upgrade Devotion, because Devotion's pretty dang good, too. And we're just going to scoot. So, Nirvana is stupidly expensive, but I can afford it. Otherwise, Devotion. Ah, Nirvana. Okay. That's obnoxious. What do we do? They're both going to hit me. I guess we'll just do a protect. Burn slimed. Swivel. Cut, cut through fate. Kill that guy. Draw a card. Uh, scry and draw a card. Actually, no. Lose that. We get cheap vigilance. I like I like cheap vigilance. I like cheap eruption. Let's see. I've got a strike and another strike. And he's dead. Cool. And we get another devotion. Obviously. If if I can just be churning devotions, that'll work amazingly well for me. So he's going to give me for 12. So I probably don't want to erupt here. I could, but it would hurt. It would hurt and it would be silly. Let's see, cut through fate. Gets me a cheap eruption. I don't really want cheap eruption. Let's see, what is this build missing? Gambling chip? Hell yeah, it's missing gambling chip. Gambling chip would be amazing. Oh. Uh, oh, it's because we don't have anything ahead of us. Uh... I guess we're just going for cheap strikes here. And upgrade as many things as I can. Okay. This this is a great round for erupting. Uh, let's see. Spirit Shield. Two block for each card in your hand. Yes. That is pretty much guaranteed to always be pretty good. We're going to keep uh, upgrading Devotion. Okay. So, Devotion, Nirvana. And I'm going to pop Protect and Defend. It's... Even if they're not immediately or amazingly the most useful, we're going to drink the... Uh... Dupe Potion. This is going to get silly! And... I'm going to erupt at him? I should have done that else time, but that's fine. Because I immediately go into Divinity Stance. Which means triple damage. So, cut through Fate, draw a card. Get rid of that. We get a Swivel. Gets me a free strike. Defend. Defend, and then burn a Slimed. So, we still take damage here, but yeah, I gain 9 mana for a turn, so I'm going to be going into... Uh, I'm going to go into aggro mode every single round. Or every other round, I think. Which in and of itself is going to be kind of fun. Okay, so what do we got? Let's burn the slime. Burn the defend. I'm just using all my zero cost stuff to clear my hand a little bit because this is hard to parse. Uh, let's see, I got 16, so I think I'm just going to insta-give that guy. Erupt on that guy, and then just strike to kill him. Well, this is pretty fun. Uh, let's see. Draw this card, add two miracles to your hand. Exhaust. That's kind of okay. Except for miracles are kind of inconvenient. Causality into your... Metaphysics might be interesting. Purely for this run. Because, yeah, the problem is the Miracles will have a randomized cost, which is kind of inconvenience. So, let's grab Metaphysics and just see what happens. Brrr. 
So Philosopher's Stone is dangerous, but I could use the extra energy. Otherwise, Busted Crit. No, Philosopher's Stone. Uh, that does make him tougher, which is probably a bad idea. But you know what? Uh, bad ideas is how I get better at this game, or at least runs get fun. Or not, I don't know. I, look. So we're gonna mostly want to go shopping on the next area, uh, next floor, probably. Let's see, so we're, we're mid, mid bosses. So we've got one, two, three. Or no, we've got one, two on the left side, plus some bonfires. But otherwise it's just regular enemies, which is less exciting. I can get two mid bosses and a sh and two shops there. Yeah, so let's go this way. I realize it's going to break the the mob bank, but we want to get some goods. I should have gone with Black Star. But it's fine, free Nirvana. Spirit Shield. Do you take the damage or do we go Metaphysics? Nah, let's just block. We'll get a cheaper one later. Devotion. Defend. Swivel. Strike. Oh, I should have done Cut Through Fate instead now that I'm looking at it. Oh well. Strike, st strike, and protect. I know I usually roll protect as, uh, for retain, but here I'm just trying to constantly cycle cards. Vigilance. Swivel. Cut through fate. Uh, let's see. Discard, strike. Give me metaphysics. What do we do? I'll hit him with a slightly more expensive strike. Okay, so Spirit Shield would give me a, hell, a whole hell of a lot of block. But that would be like the only thing I can do. Could hit him with an eruption, but that seems like a decidedly terrible idea. Spirit Shield! Strike and strike. I will slowly chip off that plated armor of his. Okay, I could swivel. Sweeve. Cut through fate. Uh, let's see. Causality seems kind of fun right now. Causality, in retrospect, is utter horseshit and I didn't need it. Devotion! Okay. Spirit Shield it is. What do we got? Strike, strike, eruption. There we go. That's pretty good. River the Hand, Calm Apply Weak, Wrath Apply Vulnerable. It's kind of okay. Exit your stance. Alt. I don't really like any of these. None of them are expensive. Let's see. Offer gold, gain a relic. Ooh. 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 Cryptic Writings. And we get the Enchiridion. <laughs> oh. I, I hope these two synergize. If they don't, I'm going to be sad. I am sad they don't synergize, but you know what? Whatever. Adaptation. Nirvana. Uh, let's see. Devotion. What do we got? He's going to hit me for 12. Uh, let's see. I can do a bunch of damage to him. Or I could erupt, swivel, strike, and then vigilance. That's played safe. Yeah, playing it safe was smart. This guy kind of hurts. Uh, let's see, spirit shield, 12? Oh wait, no, he's not, he's not doing buff gifts to me.
Well, let's see. So, vigilance is bad. Oh, right. I mean, we've got dazes. Also, shout out to my poor moderators for fielding questions about about the Watcher. Because apparently, people really do not keep up with this game at all. And I'd say I'm... Well, I'm not surprised in the slightest. Uh, let's see. Cut through fate? We'll just cut through fate. Get rid of the spirit shields. Give me eruption. Gets me a strike. Uh, I think we'll just kill him on the next round. I'm not sure. Oh, wait. No, no, no. I have... More cards in my hand. Do we try and pop causality? Let's try and pop causality. See how much we get. The answer is not as much as I was hoping for, but we kill him on the next round anyway. But I hope now you guys understand why I lose my shit when people ask me the same question over and over again. Ooh. Establishment sounds kind of fun. But I don't know if it's that useful. I mean, we could go hard on Retain. Sanctity. Let's go Sanctity. I, I'm not doing... This is not a Retain build. Okay, so let's remove a card. What do we remove? Defend? Let's get rid of a Defend. Adaptation. Nirvana. Do we do a devotion or do we want to protect? Protect might be a little bit more necessary right now. Because this guy hurts. Okay, so... Spirit Shield. We have... Devotion. Swivel. Gets me a free strike. And then the other strike. Okay. Book of Stabbing is kind of scary. I'm kind of scary. Okay. Defend Sanctity. Sanctity draws me a Devotion. Devotion's always good. And we do not, we do not want to Eruption. Okay. Spirit Shields, always kind of appreciated. Vigilance. Spirit Shield. Now, he most certainly cannot hurt me. Uh, let's see. Swivel. Cut through fate. Uh, get rid of that. We could almost justify erupting and trying to hurt this guy for a bunch. But you know what? I'm not going to because that would be that would be silly. Honestly, I might even remove, to, remove eruption from my from my deck. Okay, let's get rid of these two. We want that strike. Strike's kind of pricey, but so be it. We get a Sanctity, we get a Vigilance, we get another strike. Strike. Defend Sanctity. Come on, give me the attack, and we kill him with the Eruption. Tori Gate's pretty good. Bowling Bash is always nice. And the rest of this is kind of bad. Let's grab Bowling Bash just because even if the price gets cranked up a little bit. Well, I'm sorry to say it, but I think it's about time... Uh, it, it's finally time that we, we break the Maw Bank. Why, do you ask? Because I can get another Devotion. <laughs> What happens when you generate too much devotion? Is there such thing such a thing as double devotion? My my thought is, what if I just generated enough devotion every turn to just stay in permanent divinity mode? It's too good, right? Okay, we're also going to grab, um... I'm gonna grab those two. Oh. No, that's regen. 
thought for a second there was the bonus health potion. I was like, maybe. That could be a, that could be fun. Okay, so we could get jaxed. Or We could get a special relic where I just start with three strength. I could get jaxed, which is hurt myself, gain strength. Or we could transform two cards, which Get out of here, strikes. Regal Pillow. That'll be nice. Deva form. Ah, diggity dang. Heck yeah. Alright, Nirvana. Devotion. Swivel. Strike. And defend. We'll wait on the other one. Let's see. Flow states. I don't really want flow states. Well, we could. Uh, bah, 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 bah. What's expensive here? So flow state would pull me out of eruption if I wanted to do that. I could do it. It's not even a terrible idea considering I have nothing else I could immediately do. I should have waited on that one. I could have done a little bit more damage. I was not paying attention. This is going to hurt. Fear no evil uh, turns me calm. I've already kind of got that. We've got a sanctity, so I should probably do a skill first. Protect, defend. Sanctity draws me a card. There's spirit shield. Tank up for reasons. Draw more. There's devotion, and I'm just going to hold on to the windmill strike. Probably should have popped devotion, but that's okay. Okay, well, this is fine. Attack potion. Cleanse evil would be interesting. Cleanse evil sounds like it'd be amazing. Maybe. Okay, let's see if I can survive these guys. Yeah. We'll see how this goes. Probably bad. Uh, let's see. Drink the attack potion. What do we want to grab? Probably reach heaven. Spirit shield, because I am actually going to be in a very bad state real fast. Gotta go for the guy in the net. Okay, so what do we have? Cheapish Sands of Time. We have a Bowling Bash. Bowling Bash is not a bad idea. Mainly because the rest of these guys are going to hurt me pretty bad. Oh, thank you, Tori Gate. Man, where was this the last round? Okay. Devotion... Let's see, fear no evil. Can I kill him in any way, shape, or form? We could swivel. What did I just use? Was that spirit shield? I think it was. So let's do sanctity. Nope. Cleanse evil. Oh. In retrospect, that was more expensive. This will be fine, maybe. Huh, because now we have... stuff. So, I could erupt. It would cost a lot of damage. Or, it would cost a lot, though. It would let me do some amount of stuff to these guys, especially because I'm kind of in a bad way. But I shouldn't do that. Uh, let's see. So I've got I've got sands of time. I've got some things. Okay, so we're gonna strike this guy. 
That actually works really well. Thorough Violence, Sands of Time. Another strike. Eruption. We go pissed off mode here. There we go. Could have gotten a little bit better, but I don't know how much better. Okay, we've got the Regal Pillow, so we're just going to heal. Not back up to full, but full enough. Bank's still pissed off at me, but that's okay. Uh, let's see. So, Prey would be hilarious. Orange Pellets is kind of fun. Halt, Fasting... Oh, more. Did they make these cheaper, by the way? It feels like they made relics considerably cheaper. I'm gonna grab Pennib and Violence. Let's see. Hey there, new, th new from YouTube. Love your content. Can't wait for more O&I videos. Unfortunately, that's gonna have to wait just for a little while, as I am currently uh, utterly buried in a bunch of other games. And it's putting me in a bad way. Uh, let's see. What do we do here? So I've got flow state. So I could erupt. Now let's just do Nirvana and protect. Because I don't, I don't want to erupt. Erupt is a bad. Is a bad trap right now. Hi. Those are some cards. None of them are really rolling low, though, which is unfortunate, but that's okay. Uh, let's see. Pop Devotion. Sands of Time is cheap, but it can get cheaper. We could do Metaphysics. We could do Sanctity. I guess we'll just do that. Unfortunately, the expensive protects... Yeah, maybe the Retain build isn't the greatest idea. We gotta start killing her. Let's see, what do I got? Six damage? Six. Now, let's see, we could do Windmill Strike, but that's a bad idea. Let's just gain two smites. But yeah, unfortunately that Protect is never gonna get cheaper. Which is kind of annoying. Uh, let's see. So we have a Sands of Time. We have a Sanctity. We have a Clen Cleanse Evil Plus, which is... In retrospect, that's a terrible card. And I'm not sure why I picked it up in the first place. Let's do Protect. Sanctity. Devotion. Sands of Time. I guess we'll start burning these. Okay. And realistically, at this point, we're all good. Gambler's Brew is kind of nice. Judgment. Enemy has 30 or less HP. Set it to zero. That's not bad. I don't really like any of these. I mean, like, Judgment's kind of neat, but it's super limiting. Uh, do we heal? Who are we up against? Up against that guy. It might not be terrible. What could we upgrade? That would be good. Four randoms. Cleanse evil. Cleanse evil's bad. I should get rid of it. Upgraded causality. Spirit shield plus might not be terrible. You know what? I'm going to play on the safe side. We're going to heal. Nirvana. And also Nirvana? I, sadly, I don't think double Nirvana does anything. I wish it did, because that'd be kind of rad. I'm just going to do those two. Okay, so I've got Flow State. Let's do Spirit Shield. Why is that doing... Oh, we got Pendium.
Uh, let's hit him with Bowling Bash in that case. Hit him with Sands of Time. Sands of Fate. Hit Metaphysics. Might as well. I would have liked to kill all these guys, but hitting the boss for that amount of damage is kind of hard to pass up. Defend. I want to do Violence, but we should probably... Uh, causality? Might be interesting. Oh. Zoop. Causality turned out to be a terrible idea. Who would have thought? Uh, let's see. Do we do another Spirit Shield? Heck yeah. Do I have anything else? Nope. We gotta protect, but I think I'm gonna hold on to that because they're not gonna—they're not gonna hurt me that much here. Okay, so cheap flow state. Let's get let's get mad. I can do. S I can't do shit damage. This sucks. We've got like one aggressive move, and then everything else is just kind of bleh. I guess we got like one or two. We might have also been in divinity mode, and I'm not entirely sure. Well, he's not hitting me anyway, so I guess this is fine. Plans evil for nothing. But it upgrades it, so I guess I'll take it. And we get hacking curses. Okay, so what do we got? Sands of Time, Fear No Evil. I guess let's go Eruption. Fear no evil. Let's just burn the really expensive Protect. See if we can get a cheaper one later. Ow! Well, we have Vigilance. We're probably gonna want it. Hit him for a hell of a lot of damage, though. And then... Just that. Yeah, that hurt. We'll be okay. Okay, now we're in mad mode. Unfortunately, mad mode does not do a whole lot of bonus damage here. It sucks a little. Never mind. It does a hell of a lot. What? Sure. Okay, Dave of Form Plus. Play all of the cards. Ah, uh, we gotta go Dave of Form. Unraveling is amazing. All of your cards in your hand from left to right, targets are chosen randomly. That sounds amazing. But Dave of Form is just safety. Oh, uh, let's get the Fusion Hammer. I already upgrade cards just by using them, so just massive energy pools is going to help me way more. Okay, do we go back to mid-boss hunting? We might as well. This doesn't look like a bad situation. And we can we can take a left uh hard left at any of these points if we wanted if we want to get other stuff done and heal. Probably want to go after this mid-boss, not the other one. Sounds good to me. All right, so da uh, Deva form, Nirvana, adaptation, devotion. Other devotion's kind of expensive, but that's fine. Windmill strike. Uh, we will retain that. Bowling bash. You die. Thank you. Other devotion. You know, in retrospect, I should probably pop the windmill strike just to. Yeah, I should do that. Okay, so what do we got? Swivel? Swivel lets me kind of do some stuff. Let's do Vigilance, Flow State. Let's just get pissed off and fight things. Let's see, what do I got? Swivel? Uh, let's see. Burn that. Gets me a spirit shield. Spirit shield's pretty dang good. Spirit shield. Sands of time. 
You're dead. Congratulations. Boop. Boop? Eh, yeah, that's good enough. There's a lot of daisies in my deck already. I do not appreciate. Uh, let's see. Any of these? Yes. Protect plus. Always. Maybe. Uh, portal to the boss? Heck no. I mean, I could do it. I just don't like the idea of it. So, Nirvana? Cheap Nirvana. Let's see. Dave of Form seems like a good idea against these guys, especially because I don't see anything amazing that I need to worry about right now. Do we do Flow State? Do we just burn Flow State? Let's just burn Flow State. Bye! I don't know. I like the idea of it. I just don't know if I'll ever really use it. Spirit shield, save my bacon. What else do we got? Sands of time, that'll get cheaper. Windmill strike will not, which is annoying. Swivel. Strike. How much damage are they going to do to me? 18, 28, 37. Yeah, so good time for that. And fear no evil. Go calm. Now, I could do an eruption, but that would be a that would be a bad move. Okay, so what do I got here? A lot of things. Some good, some not so great. Defend Sanctity. Draws me a card. Bowling Bash. That does some dang bitch. Uh, let's slam -o that guy. I guess I'll pop the Devotion. Okay, so other Devotion... Protect. Fear no evil? Yes. Nope, we don't want to do fear no evil. That's a that's a bad idea. Insta gib him. Nirvana. Cut through fate. Hurt him pretty bad. Grab the windmill strike. Hit him pretty bad. We're not gonna be able to kill them both though. Well, I'll just hit him. Uh, and that gets me a violence, which gets me a bowling bash. Interesting. Uh, let's see. Another protect. I like protect. Do I get double Deva form? Yes. That's just mean. I love it. Uh, let's see. Do we do swivel? I'd swivel, but this guy... Well, I'd, I'd swivel to erupt, but that seems like a bad idea. So I'm just going to hit him. I probably should have just popped the other cards just to upgrade them. Oh, well. Uh, let's see. Devotion, Bowling Bash, Vigilance. Cut through Fate. Pop that. Keep the Devotion. Devotion's kind of expensive, but 100% worth it. And I guess he's going to hit me for five damage. I'll leave. Sorry, one damage. Devotion, metaphysics. We've got a Sands of Time, so that's good. I guess we'll cleanse evil so we have a smite on the next round. Sands of Time. Smite. Windmill strike. We have some very expensive protects. Do I burn them or do we go violence? Violence doesn't get me biscuits. Oh, right, because we had nothing. Well, that's okay. I totally forgot Nirvana uh, going into divinity mode also gets me... Let's see. Let's just pop the expensive protects. My build at this point is just exist until exist until it's time to go divine. Go divine. Beat shit out of thing. Uh, let's see. Cleanse evil plus would be interesting but bad. Causality. Causality has cut through fate. 
gives me Bowling Bash, and then we can do Fear No Evil. There we go. Perfect. Oh, let's see. Crescendo. I don't really like any of these. We're doing ridiculously good on this run. I believe somewhat in myself. We need establishment bad. Everything else is kind of nice, but establishment is a problem. Do we Yeah, let's let's remove cards. Let's get rid of cleanse evil. I like the idea of it, but the execution is bad. Oh, and I have no space for this. Can I Gambler's brew. Get rid of the uh Get rid of that for a power potion. I don't know what boss we're up against, but powers seem like they're a good idea. Master Reality. Smiter Safety. Smite? Smite. Let's see, Nirvana Plus? Probably a good idea. We also have Devotions. He's also going to hit me for 16. like the look of any of these. This is gonna hurt a bit. I don't really I don't really like writhing mass that much. Luckily we got Deva form to kinda balance this out. So we got a cheap protect. And then we gotta focus on killing him sooner than later. And I'm not super happy about these draws. If that'll keep me going. Bowling bash? Not that much better. Oh, there's the parasite. On the plus side. We can just ace him. Really stinking fast. Deva form is kind of nuts. Uh, let's see. I guess let's lose the Gambler's Brew in favor of the Power Potion. Vengeance, Clear the Mind, Wreath of Flame. Nah. Wreath of Flame sounds kind of interesting. But, whatever. Anyway, so we do end up with the Parasite, but it's fine. Adaptation. Nirvana. Establishment plus. Kind of bites, but I'll live. Do we do violence? Violence! Devotion, Dave of Form. He's gonna hit me for some amount. It's not bad, though. He's gonna hit, for, hit me for 21. Do Vigilance, see if I get anything interesting. The answer is Devotion, and we'll just pop a Protect Plus. Guess I could have popped it just regular protect, but this is fine. So there's windmill strike. Oh shit, that's gonna hurt. When does this guy do this much damage? I guess he always has. It's just been a while since I fought him. Uh, let's see, if I do this, that keeps me good. And then I wanna hold on to Sands of Time for the next round. No. No, oh, he goes intangible, doesn't he? He is intangible. This shit. Oh, well, in that case, we'll just pop everything that's not upgraded. Which is not much, actually. Okay. Luckily, he doesn't hurt that much, but I still hate his guts. I mean, I guess we should just hit him. God, we are perfectly synced up, too. This is ass.
Yeah, so I'm gonna have to kill him the really boring slow way, and I hate that. Spirit shield, defend, defend. Windmill strike, causality. Gets me anything interesting, eh, it gets me sand of time. But yeah, I, I gotta kill him this way because, frustratingly, he goes intangible whenever I'm in Deva, Deva form. Which is just mean. We even had Pendib, I squandered that one. Whatever, it's okay. And yeah, I don't dare erupt here. Because that's a stupid plan. Uh, let's see. Let's pop Vigilance, see if I get anything interesting. Kinda. Luckily, the Protects are keeping me nice and hale and hearty. keep drawing those burns. I'm gonna just take him down slow. On the plus side, we'll have Windmill Strike for the next round. Kill him with Eruption. Upgrade to attacks, get the money, and don't get anything that I care, care to grab. Okay, get money. Tungsten Rod's kind of fun. Let's see. And I guess I'm just going to go up this way. Because we can't upgrade anything at shops, so... I'm just going to mid-boss hunt my way through. Master Reality, we want... Safety might almost make more sense right now. Nirvana, Devotion, and Swivel. That will take a smidge of damage. Ugh. Shit, this hurts. Deva form. Strike. Safety. If we survive Stone Calendar, we'll kill the lot of them. Kind of what I've, I'm banking on. At least we got David Form to take some of the edge off. Do we draw some cards? No. We could. I don't know if it would help much. This is going to hurt. Luckily we get to heal at the next bonfire. Okay, Bowling Bash. That is... That is necessary. Oh, uh, let's see. Bowling bash that guy down. Anything else? Sands of Time. We'll do two. We'll do a skunk ton of damage to one guy. I could work on killing all of them, but I don't think that's a pl the best plan. Okay, what do I have? I've got Sanctity, I've got Protect. That gets me a Defend. That's not really what I'm looking for. We'll save Windmill for the next round. Uh, this is probably fine. They can't harm me. And I should be going into Deva mode? No, next round. It's fine. Eruption... Devotion. Windmill strike kills him. Nothing exciting. I should have gone I should have gone smite. Is this this guy's going down to the next turn. Strength or no strength, he's not a problem. Let's see, do we do swivel? Strike. Cut through face. Lose the Sanctity, get Bowling Bash. There he goes. Poison Potion, don't really care. Flurry of Blows. 
I like Flurry of Blows. On Stance Change, yeah, so we're going to be getting that back constantly. I did take some damage there. I'm still pretty confident about my mid-boss fighting abilities. It's got an adaption and bandage up. Sense of time might not have been a bad idea either. But I think this will be okay. Uh, let's see. Cheap Nirvana, Establishment, Adaption. Now, let's see. We have a Sanctity. Otherwise, we could defend. No, we've. I think we've only played powers so far. But this is my best defense anyway. Okay, so what do I got on, on this? Not great. Protect. Defend. Bandage up. And strike. Not great. I have Flurry of Blows. I don't have any of my Deva stuff going yet. It's kind of rough. I should be able to tank this guy pretty well. Let's see, what, el what else can I do? Swivel. Protect. Fear no evil. Windmill strike, flurry of blows. And then, there's my, there's my devotions. A little late on the uptick though, which is kind of annoying. Devotion, devotion, protect, bowling bash. Okay, now he gets mad. I can kind of work with it, though. Deva form, devotion, protect. And nothing I can do. I can try and hit him, but we'll be okay here. I am long conning the goddamn giant head. Feels wrong. Let's do Strike. Let's do Cut Through Fate. Lose the Defend. Maybe get a good Windmill Strike here? That's pretty good. Okay, and everything else is too expensive, but he can't hurt me. Which is good. Let's do... That. Defend. Probably should have waited on that one, but that's okay. I could do Flow State, but that would put me in a very weird and bad position. Or, no, flow state is fine. Flow state is good. Metaphysics. Let's see. Cheap protect. Flurry of blows. Sands of time. Protect again. Swivel. Fear no evil, which puts me in calm state, which lets me flurry of blows again. Boop. <laughs> and we get the odd, oddly smooth stone. Nice. Uh, let's see. Draw a card reduces cost to be interesting, but no good. And we don't have a whole lot of, like, really good damage here. Eh, my boss from... Uh, from the first area? That works well for me. Uh, let's see. Let's see, and he's not gonna hit me. I'm gonna just pop Flow State, which does nothing to me. Flow State was a mistake, but that's okay. So, I don't know if this is gonna hurt. This song 
has changed over the years. I still have Devaform, yeah? So, I guess we'll defend. Go Calm. Flurry of Blows. I'm gonna keep getting that back constantly anyway. Let's see. Fight Boss is the best choice there always, isn't it? The upgrade all cards can work really well if you don't have a whole lot of upgraded cards. Obviously. Let's see. Let's pop that Protect so it gets upgraded. Uh, but in this case, I upgrade all of my cards just by using them, so that's, like, super not worthwhile. Oh, let's see. Protect. You Swivel. Into Bowling Bash. Because Windmill Strike's gonna get cheaper. We'll hit him with Sands of Time. This guy ain't nothing on me right now. Uh, let's see, really expensive strike? I could, but why? Cheap-ish establishment. I'll grab it. We'll go back into Vigilance. Pop Violence? That ah, doesn't do me any good. Yeah, so Retain doesn't work as well with the Sneko build as I was kind of hoping it would. But that's okay. Uh, because I can more or less just raffle stomp everything anyway. Oh, shovel. That's a little... That's a little late. Uh, let's see, do we grab flying sleeves? I don't have a whole lot of damage cards, so I'll pick it up even if it's not the best idea. Nirvana. Establishment. Fasting. Fasting will be nice because it means he can't constrict. Uh, let's see... I should have done that before I did, uh, I should have done Spirit Shield before I did any of that, but you know what, whatever, we're here. I'll take a little bit of damage. I'm gonna heal right back up to full anyway. Let's see, do we do Devotion and Protect? Yeah. Let's see, Metaphysics, Bandage up. Another Devotion. I'm just gonna keep those Devotions rolling. Man, Mummified Hand would've made this kind of fun, uh, this run kind of fun. Normally with this guy, you kinda wanna, ooh, thank you, Shell. Normally with this guy, you kinda wanna go fast, cause otherwise he just, he just, uh, aggro rushes you. Not so much this time around. Uh, let's see. So what do we got? Fear no evil, cut through fate. We've got a lot of things. I guess let's just start shucking them. Cut through fate. Scry two. Let's lose protect. Get flurry of blows. And kill it with fear no evil. Okay. Flurry of blows plus? Sure. Born of influence would be fun. But getting those flurry of blows back constantly would be amusing. Uh, do we, do we heal or do we go insane and go for a dig? I'm only down 18 HP. I'm gonna go for dumb memes, bag of preparation. Heck yeah, that actually works out really, really well here. So, battle him. Establishment, Devotion, Nirvana, Deva Form, Bandage Up, Adaptation, Power Potion, Devotion, Power Potion, Other Deva form. Deva form devotion and a flurry of blows. Okay. So devotion and he's just defending up here. Scry two. Uh, I like neither of these. Cool. All right, so my hand is full. My cards are ready. Let's pop another devo devotion. Windmill, Sands of Time. Super expensive strike. Uh, I should probably pop a protection. We pop two. We might. Violence first, though. We do get a Fear No Evil, which is kind of nice. Flying Sleeve, obviously. 
Grano Evil, which lets me flurry of blows. And then I will just protect. Oh, he reduced my draw. That's inconvenient. I want to use three cards this round. Can I? Not easily. A little bit better. Uh, let's see. So, Spirit Shield. Fear no evil. And there we go. We do have 11 Mantra. How? Because I am a Mantra machine! Uh, let's see. Sands of Time. Strike. We have Eruption. I'll use it at the end here. Defend. Sanctity. Eruption. Flurry of Blows. Flow state just to get it out of here. Flurry of Blows again. And we do Vigilance Swivel. He's not going to hurt me that much. You know what? I'm just going to wait here. He's still not going to hurt me. Okay, so there's Flurry of Blows. Let's see. We want to hold on to Windmill Strike. Break him again, and Flying Sleeves. Oh, right. Because he's got his shitty heal. At halfway. Okay, so there's Windmill Strike. We've got Bowling. We'll do that. Swivel. We'll hit him with a Windmill. He's going to hit me for a decent amount. Not anymore, and fear no evil. Which lets me flurry of blows. It's not the greatest, but it's okay. Because I'm more or less skunking him constantly. Uh, are we not in Deva form yet? I think I'm confusing it. I'm gaining too much mantra, and I'm, I'm going over cap, which is hilarious. Let's hold on to Sands of Time. Uh. Azality? Okay, so now I'm mantered up. And what do I kill him with? Time. <laughs> I think I've fought. I, I think I beat him without taking so much as a piece of damage there. And we wreck the heart. Cool. Well, that was fun. And Alpha, shuffle a beta into your draw pile. Exhaust. Add an Omega to the bottom of your draw pile. Huh. Whenever you switch stances, gain four block. Cost one less per switch stance this turn. Gain eight block. Deal eight damage. That was a really fun run. Just go pure Sneko and just, just, just let it happen. Just let the run, just let the run go where it wants to go.